<laughs> Welcome to the stream. Today we are going to be uh, playing some single player survival Minecraft. So hopefully you guys are excited. Uh, we're going to be working a little bit on the the ice farm, I believe. So uh, yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be working on the ice farm. So uh, this is a project I've been working on for quite some time now. Um, even though, yeah, it's only been, I think, two episodes in the Let's Play world. Let me eat something here. There we go. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to need some more chests out here. That's one thing we need. Uh, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to the live stream. So today, guys, like I said, we're going to be working on our ice farm. Uh, we're going to be probably laying out the the outline we're gonna be putting down uh, putting down some blocks finally for this uh, laying out like the piston scheme maybe doing a slight bit of terraforming but uh, mostly just getting the area prepared and yeah getting all the stuff out here so we gotta get a bunch of snow out here uh, we got to maybe go mining perhaps for some redstone and such um, so <laughs> Yeah, Iskull, <laughs> definitely, definitely. I'm I'm bleeding from the fingers gathering some stuff. Yeah, <laughs> it has been a long, long time that I've been gathering materials for this. Um, <laughs> definitely. Uh, had to mine a lot of stuff, a lot of redstone. Still have a lot of mining t ahead too to do. Um, it's taken more than I have thought to build this farm. <laughs> Let's just say that. Definitely. Definitely a lot of stuff I have to do to, to build this. Um, we actually need a lot more redstone, surprisingly. Uh, let's see, yeah. So, definitely definitely is a lot, no doubt. Let's see if we can build a boat, yeah. Gotta go back. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Go ahead and just, yeah, basically get all of our materials taken out here. So we got some, uh, I think some... What is it? Some snow? A couple, a couple double chests of snow we gotta take out here. So we'll, we'll travel back and bring that snow out here. How's it going, Dude Monster 27 How's it going? Why are you making the farm? Because I can. <laughs> that's, that's the short explanation. Uh, but we're also gonna be putting some more stuff out here. So I wanted to have another, another farm out here. Uh, because I, I need an easy way to get ice. Um, and I mean, we could just mine it from that, from that biome over there, but I think it's better to have a farm, plus it's going to be, it's going to be really fast. Uh, we won't really have to use it too often, but when we do use it, we won't have to, uh, it's going to be so big that we're not going to have to reset it every time. So it's going to be a really, really fast way to get ice for us, if we ever need ice in the future for anything. So, let's go ahead and just head on through here. Head on through the portal. Uh, let's see here. There we go. Let me go ahead and turn down the sound for you guys. So yeah, we're going to head back. We're going to get some, uh, some of the snow. I've been collecting a lot of snow. <laughs> been grinding at the snow farm for a while. Um, as well, so that, that's something I had to do for, for some time to, uh, to get all the resources. It's not necessary to make it out of snow, I just thought it would be cool and it looks better with the, uh, the ice plains biome. Makes it blend in quite a bit more. So that's why we're doing that. Uh, Joe, Joe FR, no, Joe FI, Joe Fi asks, why don't you upload videos at 60 FPS? Um, uh, I did do that, um, for a while. Uh, I think uh, a few months ago I, I, I did that, I started doing that, but um, it turns out YouTube still has some problems with that. Uh, if it's not exactly 60 FPS, then it has some issues with that. Like, I think I was uploading like 59.97 and it would take an extra two hours to process. Um, so that's, that's sort of the short answer. Uh, the long answer is that a lot of people don't really watch at 60 FPS. Whoa, what the heck? <laughs> the gas just spawned in the in the ceiling right here, and then he goes off into the distance. Okay, but that's that's sort of the. Uh, it also it also takes a lot more drive space uh, per video, 
So that's n n another reason I haven't I haven't done 60 FPS. I mean, I can do 60 FPS, but it just it takes longer to upload. Uh, and yeah, I think I think 30 FPS is actually okay for Minecraft. Uh, if you're playing like an FPS game, like a, like CS:GO or something, 60 FPS is a lot better due to like motion blur. But uh, I think Minecraft's okay at 30 30 FPS. So thanks for the question, Joe Fi. It's a good good question. Very good question. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Yeah, let's go get this. Let's go get this snow. Let's go get this snow. Pino Dragonfly says, "I love your channel. Thanks. Appreciate it, man. Glad you're here at the uh, at the stream." Go ahead and just get in here. So yeah, the uh, the snow farm actually uh, it's over here. I actually made some modifications to it, which I didn't show in the last episode. I actually added some uh, some stuff on the inside. So like I added the chest. I added yeah the banners on the outside now. So this is like our ice plane spike basically is what this is. And then. On the inside, I added this like half slab here, and this prevents since this uh, this wall is a half half a block taller than uh, one block, so one and a half, <laughs> one and a half blocks tall. Uh, all the snow blocks or all the snow balls stay in there, uh, so it works it works fine now. Yeah, and in here we just got the stuff to make iron shovels. I redid the timing on this too, so now when you know now when you have it running, it actually is much better for, for the iron shovels than it was previously. Because uh, I think when Doc built this in his world, he did it for stone shovels, so I had to switch the timings up a little bit. Um, so, yeah. Now, in here, we got our snow blocks. Somewhere. Here. There we go. So we gotta move these. I also changed up this bit up here in this farm because um, it, it turns out that it's actually really important that you don't have any blocks touching the, um, the cobblestone wall. So you can't have, like, for instance, let me, let me get a dirt block here. So you don't want something like, like, that. That messes it up, apparently. <laughs> I did not know that, but yeah. Now, now I know. So, let's just go ahead and grab these snow blocks. Grab them over there. We'll dump off that. We have another stack. And so we're gonna, just going to grab all these and bring them out to the snow farm, or to the ice farm. All these here. All these. All these. And we'll put these in here. Yeah. There we go. Grab another bag and we'll take that out ourselves. Take that out ourselves. It is quite a distance between here and the uh, where the snow farms or where the ice farms are going in at, so it is kind of tough to get materials back and forth at times. So we should probably throw that in there. Get that last snow block, and yeah, you see we got another double chest, part of another double chest, and then another double chest. So all that has to go out. All that is going to be part of the ice farm. So it is quite a quite a number of resources. Uh, as far as the time it took to get all those, it didn't really take too bad, too terribly long because we have the fully automatic snow farm. So it wasn't really too bad. Maybe like two hours, three hours or so to do that, that portion of it. So not bad at all for that. Uh, how long do you live stream today? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, we will probably live stream for about an hour and a half or so. Um, I'm thinking probably that would, that, would, that would probably be good. Depends how much we get down done on the ice farm and how much we want to uh, if we want to do any like mining or anything. Because I want to get some blocks down. I want to do some like uh, do some actual wiring of the pistons. I don't actually have enough redstone yet to complete this, but we can get um, at least the basis done of it, like the basics done of it. 
Uh, today we are, so I am awesome asks, um, what are you going to do today in the stream? We're, we are building the ice farm up. So right now we're transporting materials. Uh, we gotta transport all this snow, so all this, all this, <laughs> all this snow, these snow blocks out to the ice farm. So that's what we're doing right now. We're transporting materials out to the, uh, where the ice farm will be, and then we're gonna put some, uh, some blocks down, some redstone down, and start it, start the build. That's what we're doing today. And like I said, I expect the stream to be about an hour long. For some reason, at this first part here, I go really slow. I'm not exactly sure, and then it speeds up at the end here. And we are inside glass blocks right now. Maybe that has something to do with it, but it seems like it goes really slow right here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. One thing I could do is I could put ice, like, put, like, ice pass in the nether, uh, w for, like, horses. And that, I think, would actually be faster than this minecart ride. So that's one potential use we could have for all this ice. Uh, I do have some other stuff planned for ice, um, in the ocean by the Guardian Farm. Uh, that has to do with, like, the ice updating. So ice doesn't update whenever it melts. So that is super useful. You can make some really cool stuff with that. And we're gonna do that, uh, in one of the next few episodes. Uh, let's see here. Okay, looks like, where are we at? We are about halfway through the night, but let's just go ahead and go out anyway. Just gotta transport our stuff. There we go. Uh, the OG villain says, love your, mine your Minecraft vids on YouTube, especially the things you didn't know about Minecraft. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, things you don't, things you might not know about Minecraft, part five is coming up very soon, guys. So I'm really excited about it. I think I finally have enough material, um, to make a whole video. Uh, because, I mean, I could make, like, smaller videos, but, um, the things are m more more well known. But these, the things I got coming up in the part five, I think, I think, uh, they're gonna be pretty, pretty obscure, pretty, um, pretty unknown, basically. <laughs> Which is what the videos are supposed to be about. Uh, things you might not know, so I think it should be good. But yeah, I'm looking forward to part 5 for that. That's coming up pretty soon. Hopefully uh, sometime in September. I think is when I'll probably put that out. Let's see here. Magpie, welcome to the stream. How's it going? Uh, yeah. Let's, we're, we're getting out here to the ice farm is what we're doing today. Building up the ice farm. And so these these pillars here, there's I have four pillars set up that are 120 blocks apart. So the whole farm is going to be 120 blocks by 120 blocks. So that's you know 14,000 blocks plus of area. And so I've actually calculated up like eh, well that boat's gone. <laughs> I've actually calculated up like exactly um, how many resources I need. And the only thing we need besides uh, like what we have already is redstone repeaters and redstone so <laughs> that is the limiting factor right now for us and we already we already made all the pistons and set and everything so we have enough pistons here so these are all our pistons all our sticky pistons and monsters might be a problem here get out of here get out okay there we go. Alright, I'm gonna sleep. That we don't have to deal with too many monsters. Don't want to deal with too many of these guys. Dump off some of this. And again, we need more chests. Uh, unfortunately, there's not any like good forest around here, and I didn't grab any chests. So, we'll have to just put some of this in here, and then go ahead and cut down ourselves a tree around here. The trees are quite <laughs> few and far between. But I think we can we can manage. I think we can find one. This one over here looks like a good good candidate. Yeah, this looks good. Got some creepers over here following us. There we go. Oh wow, not too many not too many there, huh? Yeah, 
Definitely not too many. <laughs> Get two chests out of that, that's about it though. I was expecting at least five or six wood blocks out of that, but not to be, not to be. Oh, hey, Stress. How's it going? Welcome to the stream. Kingdom Crash representing the stream today, guys. That's cool. Alright, let's go ahead and put this down. Let's see, we got all that. Alright, good. Get some of this down. So, let me, let me go ahead and actually... I think we can probably... Well, yeah, we should probably just go ahead and keep moving the materials for right now, I'd say. Um, I was gonna, like, go ahead and see how, like, what level we can make this at, so, yeah, like I said, these pillars are gonna, are like the, the edges of the, the farm, so you can see one pillar way, way, way down there, and so I'm thinking maybe, I'm trying to think what would be a good level for this, because it's gonna have to be, I don't wanna have to clear out too much land here, basically. And it's easier to put it, like, in the ground. Let me go ahead and turn up the sound again. It's easier to put this, like, in the ground than it is to build it above ground. Which is one of the reasons we picked this spot. Uh, one of the reasons we picked this spot on Tuesday's stream. So, um, I'm thinking maybe we go either at 64 or 63 height level. I'm thinking maybe 63. And that means we'll probably have to uh, fill in at least part of this river here. Just trying to determine like how, how much we'll have to clear out. Have to clear out this bit, obviously, but the river, yeah, I mean, hmm. I think it would be best if we have it like at this level or this level. Maybe this level, maybe this level will be good. That we wouldn't have to clear out too much. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think that'd probably be best, actually. So what we'll do, we'll go ahead and put it at 64. I think this is 64. Yeah, 64. Height level 64 is where we'll put it. So we'll have to clear everything above that. So like all this, we'll have to just clear all this stuff out. And we have to clear out part of that mountain, this hill. <laughs> so quite a bit of terraforming involved. But it shouldn't be too bad. It shouldn't be too bad. But yeah, y equals 64, and then we'll fill it. We'll fill over the uh, the river, the frozen river, and so we'll put the farm on top of 64, basically. So we're gonna have what it'll be like is this. So we'll have. Let's see. This is 64 right here, right? Yeah. So we'll have. Um, let's see. We'll have piston, snow. So this piston's not necessarily going to go here, but just as an example, it'll go like this. So it'll go, you'll have, actually not that, you'll have, yeah, we'll have a block, a piston, and then the actual farm layer will be here, the snow layer. So this will be like the layer of the farm right here, just like that. And then you'd basically go up two over one, and then you'd go do it the same type of thing. So it'd be block, piston, and then again snow. And then this would be filled in like this, like that. And then this just repeats over the whole 120 <laughs> block section. So I think that'll be good. Maybe we can build up something here. I think the middle of this whole thing would probably be like around this area, so we may have to move this this bit here because I want to be able to control it from a central spot too. But if we're gonna have it at that height, yeah, I'm th I'm, th I'm thinking here. I'm thinking. I'm thinking how we can do this. Hmm, 64. It's gonna be 65. So it'd be 60 at 67 height. Is that right? 66 height, okay. That, that's decent, I think. That'll work well coming off this mountain, too. It's even over there. And right here, it's just one step up. So, yeah, I think that's good. I think that's good. Yeah. Alright, so let's let's keep moving some stuff out. I'm just going to leave that stuff 
where it is. And we don't need this. We need to get some chests out here, too. Get all that out. Okay, good. Got it. Nice. All right, let me see. Um, doo -doo -doo. Uh, where's the face cam? The face cam, I decided not to do face cam today because I'm super, super tired. <laughs> um, and, yeah, I only got, like, I think three hours of sleep in the past 48 hours. I actually celebrated a birthday over the weekend, or not over the weekend, over this past week. Um, so I was, I was, uh, I wouldn't say like partying, but, um, had some time with, uh, family and friends, and that sort of, uh, threw off my schedule a little bit. So I'm quite tired right now. Looks like we got a boat over here in waiting. I was going to get some wood, but we got some over here. Yeah, we got one over here. Perfect. Just waiting for us. Ghost boat. Here we go. <laughs> Ghost boat hype. Uh, let's see. Sounds are really loud. Are they really loud? 65%. They shouldn't be too bad. I think they should be all right. Uh, let's see. What do you need so much ice for? You willing to spend a double chest of stickies on? <laughs> That's a good question. Um, not quite sure yet. Uh, well, actually, I do kind of know, but I don't want to spoil it. Um, yeah, you you'll see some of it soon. Um, it's not necessarily going to be all ice that that does it, but it's going to be something in this section here that's going to be kind of cool. So it's, yeah. I, I do have something something planned, but I don't want to spoil it too much. And also, it's nice just to have the ice farm back up and running because, yeah, we haven't had it run for a while. And I don't have too much ice. I have maybe, maybe a couple stacks of ice. But yeah, it's also just a cool challenge to build it. Uh, because it's going to be absolutely massive. So it's actually just a cool challenge to build it to. Uh, let's see, we go here, 10%. There we go, turn down the minecart sounds. For some reason the minecart sounds still are, are really loud. I'm not sure why that is, but they are. Uh, let's see here. <coughs> Sounds are good. Okay, people saying sounds are good. Uh, Mike is a little too low. <laughs> that might be me <laughs> just being tired. Uh, I can try to speak it up, speak up a little bit. Speak more into the mic. Uh, how big will the ice farm be? The ice farm is going to be 120 blocks by 120 blocks. Uh, I've decided. And that means it's going to produce uh, 10,800 blocks, 10,800 ice blocks every about 20, 25 minutes. Which I think is probably more than um, <laughs> than is really necessary, frankly. But um, it'll be nice because if I ever have a big project with ice, like if I make an ice palace or something, um, we'll have plenty of ice to do that with. But yeah, it's going to be 100 and 120 by 120. So, <laughs> huge. Really big. Really, really big. How tall will it be? Uh, the ice farm is going to be three, three blocks or four blocks tall, depending on how you measure it. So it's going to have like, like a like a layer of redstone, followed by like a layer of blocks that'll be powered, and that's going to be uh, with pistons sitting on top. And it'll be automatic. It'll be a uh, automatic reset. Well, not automatic. I'd say automated reset. Um, because you actually have to har harvest the ice still. Uh, it's not going to push it into a cube or anything because that makes it a lot slower. I found. I did some uh, some tests which I which I showed on Tuesday. Uh, that yeah basically shows that if you put it into a cube, it's good if you have it like if I built it like around here somewhere, but. 
unfortunately have all warm biomes around my house. So you lose some speed if you go with the the, the push.